Good afternoon, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com coming at you with a personal box of 2018 Topps Heritage Baseball. Spots left says 11 because this comes from a fresh 12 box case. Heritage stuff has been hot, hot, hot. And where is my Sharpie? I just get, this just gets taken away from me every time. Unbelievable. Forever searching. This is. This is. I feel like. I feel like three quarters of my day is always looking for a sharpie. Okay, here we go. Let's uh, let's mark all these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Twelve is. Twelve is right there. Okay. Now we'll go to random.org and we'll generate a number between 1 and 12 right here on the on the uh, right side of your screen. I don't know why I'm moving around my screen here. There we go. Okay. 1 and 12. And the lucky box is going to be box 2. Box 2. That'll be this one right here. So. Good luck, Box 2. Good luck, Joseph Johns. Let's see if we can find some... Uh, I mean, basically, we're Otani hunting. Let's be, let's be real here. We're Otani hunting. However, some of, the, some of the variations here I've seen will be able to get uh, the cost of the box back. Especially, like, some of the, some of the nickname variations, some of the shorter prints, all that. I'll save this for the end of the box. All right, good luck, Joe. Thanks for grabbing spots in this, uh, or the spot a box in this. If you want a personal box, jazbeeshobbylad.com, go for it. Otani is definitely what everyone's looking for. But be sure to look at the serial numbers on the back of the cards if you get any of these folks. And check out CardboardConnection.com. CardboardConnection.com also has uh, a great resource to see what all the short prints are. And then if you study the, uh, or if you look at the backs of these cards right here, you'll be able to tell which are base cards and which are short prints. A lot of people still build sets out of these, so keep that in mind. Oh, TJ is saying that uh, that his local card shop in Tulsa, OK, pulled a red auto Otani this past Saturday. Wow. Well, there's one one less in the world now. Oh, actually, I didn't look. What did that? So one of the first Otanis that was posted on uh, on auction. I actually didn't see what the final the final price of that was. That closed at, wow, that closed at $4,800. So one of the first Otani red ink autographs that were pulled and posted on eBay, $4,800. That's crazy. See if we could pull one of those autographs. Uh, the autographs are out of 69, by the way. Uh, 
All right. Joseph Johns, good luck. Oh, we see the relic out here already. So unfortunately, no autograph. But let's look for even like an Otani short print or even just a regular base card could, uh, could should pay for the box. This is a numbered one, though. Nice. 21 out of 99. Nice relic. Nice Chris Davis relic on a thicker cardstock, too. All right, so that's cool. Set that right here. Now let's see, let's see what else we can find for you. I'm gonna try to spot nickname, uh, nicknames. Maybe the rookie cups errors on those. Maybe a color swap. Action variations. Those are some of the ones we're looking for. Still 2017. So we got on this side. Those are facsimile autographs. Now be sure to double check the backs of these cards anyway because I'm, there's a good chance that I may have missed a sort of more more uh, harder to spot variation. There's Corey Kluber out of 9.99. Oh, Tyler T bought a box as well. All right, Tyler. Well, that's kind of that's gonna be coming up next, I think, unless a break sold out in between then. I think we went through these, right? Yeah. All right. Let's slide this over here. Some of, these, some of those Aaron Judges, those all rise. Oh, by the way, Ichiro in the, in the uh, Mariners camp. I don't know if that Zach Davies is. No, it's just a regular base card. Looks like another Chrome card coming up, though. And it's Corey Seager. You got two. This one's 412 out of 569. Nice. Yeah, that, that always, no, the Carlos Correa is not a action one. It's 2017. And Brian Dozier. Looks like that is going to be that's going to be that. Well, there you have it. Let's check out what's inside here, Joseph Johns. We're going to get Ron Reed. Your 1969 original is Ron Reed. Nice. And there you go. Nice personal box for Joseph Johns. Thanks very much for grabbing one. I think another one's going to be coming up right now. So uh, if you want to get out, get, get some personals going, folks. JaspiesHobbyLine.com. A lot of fun stuff in here. A lot of cool treasures to chase. We'll see you next time, folks. Bye-bye.